excited about high tide, mate? Yeah, it looks like it's going to be good. We've got some waves down the bottom end. You can see the big peaks rolling in. And uh, I think as soon as this backs off a bit, the tide, then we'll be, uh, we'll be on. Enjoying it? Aye. Wound? Yeah, I got stinging. I didn't really start the heat brilliantly, kind of catapulting onto the rocks. So uh, I've got a bit of a wound on there, and a bit of a fleshy wound Ooh, on there. There's, yeah. there's a flat that's covered in sand. So. Oh, for, nice wave, epic. Yeah, first wave was good, solid, uh, nice air on it. It was nice and smooth, so you could do a setup turn and then boost the air. So Phil Horrocks is sitting pretty at the top of the tree. Good win from him in the single elimination. Really good result for Finn Mellon as well uh, in second place. Uh, Andy Bobble Chambers third and James Cox in fourth place. We've already kicked off the double. We've had absolutely perfect down the line and more hollow waves. The main man though, Timo Mullen, he's fought his way right back. He just had a close one with uh, Ben Page there to see who could go against James Cox in that battle for the fourth place. And uh, to wait all day watching these guys sail this morning when it was super fun as well. It was, uh, it was really nice. And then uh, the final came, rain score came through and the wind just got really strong. I chose what I thought was the wrong board. It was a big board, but in the end it got me around, got me lots of waves and eventually that was enough to get the points. So. <laughs>